New at five, a Pewaukee police sergeant becomes the victim of a suspected drunk driver. That sergeant survived and now his colleagues have a message. Mary Jo Ola live in the newsroom with that story. Mary Jo. Yeah, Carol, Pewaukee police say they're thankful that no one was killed, but this crash could have been prevented. This is how fast life can uh, go past in front of you. Detective Craig Drummy shows us what's left of the Pewaukee squad car that was hit early Sunday morning. You can see the extensive damage to the uh, front of the vehicle. According to a criminal complaint, Sergeant Nicholas Welch was going west on Capitol Drive in Pewaukee around 1.30 Sunday morning. Samantha Sable was going east when she ignored a yellow flashing arrow on a turn and smashed into the squad car. Both drivers were taken to a local hospital. This was borderline a head-on collision. Um, if it would have been tenths of a second uh, later, he would have gone, the gal would have gone right into the uh, driver's side door. Court documents say Sable told investigators she drank three White Claws at a friend's house and consumed intoxicants until about 45 minutes before the crash. Sable said numerous times she should not have been driving. Authorities noted Sable did not pass field sobriety tests and on a preliminary breath test, she blew a .166. She was charged with a first offense OWI. Pewaukee police hope sharing this story will remind others one bad choice can change people's lives. You're taking your own chances of in hurting yourself or others. Sergeant Welch was treated and released from the hospital. Pewaukee police say last year they had 43 drunk drivers and 31 drugged drivers in their area alone. Live in the newsroom, Mary Joola, today's Team J4.